Even though they're not at home, you want to make them feel at home. It's a world-renowned hospital in the heart of the natural state, but Arkansas Children's does so much more than just treat sick or injured kids. This is one-of-a-kind medical center is also making a big difference. Tonight, Aaron Nolan is searching for solutions in the halls of Arkansas Children's Hospital. Marin Selig is a 17-year-old, soon to be senior at Mount St. Mary's. I brought y'all some blankets, some warm blankets. She's spending part of her summer in the emergency room of Arkansas Children's Hospital. I've always been into like the medical field. Marin is one of nearly 100 area teens in the hospital's junior volunteer program. They're going to be our future. They're going to be the ones that are caring for, you know, for our kids and for our adults and as we go forth. So we want to make sure that we're teaching them. Now this program runs in June and July and is for students from 14 to 18 years old. And they're doing more than just learning. They're also making an impact. Spend a little bit of extra time with our patients, um, relieve some stress from our staff, um, do those little things that sometimes staff don't always have time to do. Take a foam blanket. Even though they're not at home, you want to make them feel at home. So when I leave, I'm very happy. Now, Marin is learning a lot. To help the efficiency mm -hmm. of all of our jobs, yeah. I guess. It's really cool. And no doubt, she'll take advantage of this opportunity. But she also knows she can be part of a solution. You can do what you want and still have fun, but you're still giving back and helping other people, too, as well. Searching for solutions in Little Rock, I'm Erin Nolan. The application process for next year's junior volunteer program will wrap up in April of 2019.